step away. Uh, I'm going to be stepping in here. Uh, welcome everyone to Combo Breaker 2017. This is Mr. Rockman here with Darth Arma. Good to see you again, Darth. It's been too long. It's been too long. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for bringing the hype because I know that's what you're going to be doing. Absolutely, guys. We're going to have one heck of a show for you guys tonight. And it's so good to see you coming back from Injustice One Days. <laughs> it's been a long time. We've missed you as a community on the mic, so it's really good to have you back. Thank you so much. That means so much to me. That means the world to me. Uh, who do you have for this? Illusions just not going, not going with Deadshot. I thought he was going Deadshot. That's why I went on this whole rant about Deadshot and how everyone yeah. loves him. But he's going with another zoner, Green Arrow. He, he actually may have gone in with, with, with the mental counterpick in mind because uh, Green Arrow, Illusions is a player from Injustice One. This is this is his character, legacy character from Injustice One. That low fire arrow actually does some some great work against Deadshot. It goes under his straight shot. Not only does it punish it, it does fantastic damage. So so he, he actually wins the full screen game from, from from what I've seen so far. And I don't know about win, but he can he can, he can contest with Deadshot full screen. And you see here a tie going with Catwoman, which is a completely different play style than we saw here in Mortal Kombat X, where he was a katana player and he's looking to play a little more offensive. It looks like. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, Illusions, I, I feel like he really found his stride in MKX, just blew up as a player in general. Oh, for sure, especially early on. He had so many results, getting multiple top eights, and succeeding all the way throughout the entire game's lifespan, and I'm glad we have him here in Injustice 2. All these new guys that came in, going forward into the new game, and of course you see here Illusions playing a great space game. They gave some uh, some great changes to Green Arrow. They actually gave him a hit confirmable launcher. I don't know why, Paolo, but he needs it. He needs it. Uh, some characters can punish it. Batman can punish it with a trait. <laughs> and here we go, the full screen game. Catwoman, you want to keep out? She has great. She has a great stagger game. She has huge damage in this game, and a, and a couple of new moves of her own. You want to keep her out, but you also don't want to just mindlessly zone because if she gets that meter burn cat dash. Cat dash she is, is going to hurt you. Not only that, but her jump in range is ridiculous. It's a jump two best jump in the game. And did you see there? That was actually a bait out of the meter burn air tech by a tie. He went for a cat dash. And, and didn't do meter burn as Illusions actually air checked out of it. That was so smart from Atai to actually bait that out. Atai looking for the cat dash and Illusions does not punish it on whiff. Goes for his nice new launcher. Might have been able to get more off that, but I, I respect getting up the fire trait because it gives you much more options, especially your full screen. You have to respect it, especially when he jumps in the air. Because he can let it go straight in the air. If you try to jump reading, then he's going to go low on it. There's so many mind games here in Injustice, ladies and gentlemen. Fire arrows are great. They hurt way more. And not only that, they knock you down and push you back, which is so annoying because you made some progress getting in on this owner. Get back to full screen, yeah, sir. Just go back. Just get back. Oh, there's that jump too. And catching him right. But he has not confirmed the cat dash twice now into a full combo. Fire arrows, fire arrows, illusions, trying to keep his spacing, just staying away. No reason for him to go in. No reason to put himself at risk. Oh, what a down two from a tie, but no conversion. That was pretty wonky on the down two. Yeah, he flipped himself over to the other side accidentally. Ooh. This is pretty much all illusions game, all wrapped up. No reason to lose this unless he's a real master. Never mind. Clutch tech there by a tie, but the invincible stinger is going to close it out there for illusions. Do we have a coaching rule yet? I'm not too sure, but here comes Too Easy, one of his fellow OD boys from, from down in Florida. OD. Those, those guys were, when they came onto the MK scene, they were the true testament to back in the MK9 days where they traveled together, they competed together, and they stood behind their players. And you want to talk about smack talk? Ooh. See, scene versus scene, the last time I experienced that in uh, in tournament play was the OD guys standing around their guy, and I, I, I happened to be with all my local guys behind a guy, and it was it was that scene on scene uh, rivalry from back in the day that, that we're kind of lacking here as we as we progress here in the Are we? Is it? I mean, I guess that's what it is. We are progressing, and I think everyone's just getting that mindset like let's all come together and help each other out. But we are missing that rivalry. You're right. Absolutely, and it okay. looks like yeah, it looks like Illusions did not press a single button there. Yeah, no, uh, I think we're doing. I think he was letting a tie check his button because you, you saw he went for meter cat dash. He could I didn't see one meter burn cat dash that entire he first game, yeah, so he, so that that may have been it. But it's still gonna count. Uh, you got it's your responsibility Ooh. to check your buttons, make sure they're right. Absolutely, and a great read on the on the jump too. But you see Illusions the moment he gets hit, he rebuilds the space immediately, forcing a tie to make reads in. And he's punishing him accordingly. And he's gonna go and he does. Gonna load up fire. Oh, still had a fi one fire arrow left. Goes to space, and there's oh. a, there's that meter burn cat dash. That's why you can't mindlessly zone. A lot of people think there's no thought behind zoning, but there's so much mind games going behind a full screen game. Especially in this game where there's so many options. Just every character has meter burn roll. 
There's, there's always something that, that can be done. Full screen and did he, not get that back three in time. He tried to time it. It was a little tricky, and it's one of those situations you don't put yourself in too many times. Ty here trying to whip it good, but, but unable to get the healthy so far. He's so close. ty has been so good at teching every single throw. Everything, every time Illusion's tried to grab him, or, or I guess Illusion's just been conditioning him to expect the throw. Oh, that's a good crouch on the trait, and a tie here taking the lead. It was his button, it was all his button, that's all it was. Illusion's with these fraudulent wins. <laughs> Absolutely. He said, I, I didn't mean to bring Cat Dash, your zoning was fraudulent that very first game. And look at this man, and th there you go. That right there, he did not meet a burn in the last game. So looking much better, having his meter burn button. It's a whole new player when you can actually meter burn, huh? All right, and Ali decides to go for two bars, 25%. That's a pretty good deal. Oh, trying to whip, but barely dodging that. Did you know that Catwoman has a whip that says Bruce's favorite? Yes. Oh, here we go. I was aware. I think I saw you tweet it out. It needs to be explained. And wonderful conversion by Illusions to get the corner pressure. Oh, dodge, dodges. Oh, he's burning. He's, he's burning, burning right now. He's burning. He's getting a taste of his own medicine, as it were, with those fire arrows. That's true. Catwoman's not going to take that lying down. Oh, I think that could have been a neutral jump, too, but he just wasn't sure if he was going in or staying out. And that that is the mix-up in Footsie Rangers. Are they going to come in? Are they going to come out? Dashers are very reactive in this game, so a lot of people can down one punish accordingly when someone tries to dash in or, or just check with your fastest advancing normal. Great tech by Catwoman. Oof. And the jump in, too, for a full combo, but didn't have the meter. And there have been a few competitive players playing this character. We've seen Samij. We hope 16 comes back. 16 bit comes back, please. Please, please, 16 bit. And back to the full screen game where he has to make a read. And good block. A lot of people forget that overhead at the end. It's very sneaky. Very and sneaky overhead, especially when you're coming straight from a low. And then the green arrow, green arrow first can actually mix it up if they decide to meet a burner or not. And then get away with murder with it with the raw one. Oh! And Big. the boxing arrow this time. Oh, not fast enough! That trait recovery was ridiculous on that cat dash. And full screen. Fire arrow up, and one of these might chip out, and that's going to do it from Illusions. Going up 2-0 on a tie. Much better from a tie, though. Definitely much better. A tie had control that entire match and just slowly lost it. I feel like Illusions kind of mixed it up. I feel like he, in the beginning of that match, he kept relying on zoning, 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 and then he just, out of nowhere, got so aggressive at the end, and uh, yes. he didn't know how to deal with it. A tie found his way in. After, after the heavy zoning start, and once the tie found his way in, got the health lead, and then Illusions, changed, he, he didn't wait until the next game to change it up. He changed it up right there on the spot and got aggressive. Ooh. And, and you saw that aggression right there from Illusions. He did, he, he did a trait from, from Sweet Distance, and he's gone in twice after it already. He dashed in the first time, and they're trying to check him with the back one three, I believe it is. Oh, get on the corner. That is a great knockdown. And here comes some mix with Catwoman. And just simply Ogies this man. Wake ups are not as dominant as they were to Justice One. That's going to kill here from a tie coming out swinging here in game number three. Look at this life lead. He's got at least 80% on his still on his first bar. Can we cut back to the game? Thank you. And Ollie just trying to get something going. And a tie just doing his, the little damage, his little Ooh. guaranteed things that he can do. What a reaction holding the trait to, to, to the jumper from Illusions. That was ridiculous. The jump in two, giving Catwoman miles and miles of a health. Oh, go for that almost full screen. Is that a teabag? Low whip, and that did look like a teabag. I don't oh. know. I don't know what don't buffer know. she has that is down down. Teabag, that's what the buffer is. If I see an Aquaman player or, 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 or something be doing that, they could be buffering water shield. But I don't know what this woman is trying to, to buffer. Maybe he just wants a teabag. Oh, oh, no, my God, teabag right there in the neutral. He's feeling himself. He's like, I'm dodging everything. This is, Panic. This is coming from the MK Times where, where, where the teabags happen. You try to get in your opponent's head mentally, and, you, and here we go. Establishing a little bit of dominance here in game number three. Getting some momentum. That's what it's all about here. Into the corner. It's going to be the mix. Oh. Wake up. I'm getting a little too aggressive, but look at the healthy right now from a tie. And what a read with the jump by Sarah, but no conversion. No conversion. He just barely whiffed on that jump in three. Illusions is going to kick himself for that, especially if he loses his entire set. This match looks like it's pretty much over. Catwoman just needs two more throws. A meter burn, a meter burn cat dash into back three, anything. And what's very unique is that that cat dash, back three, you cannot air tech out of it. There is no escape. Now right there, not recognize that the back three was a little close, but that's going to close out a tie getting back in here. Very smart of a tie to not giving uh, give him that, a man. flashable he is focused situation. Right now. Oh, he yeah. is so focused, and this is the a tie that was scared.
scary to watch. And I, I played him personally in Mortal Kombat. This man is a mental wall. He is such a great player, and I'm glad that we have him here in the NRC. Lucian's trying to get some space. Just backing himself slowly into the corner, and Atai doing a good job of blocking most of these arrows. Oh, just blocked the overhead this That's time. That's the first time he didn't block the overhead. He was so on point with it. Over three, and the yeah, FIRE catch them jumping back. It's such a guess when he's going to let that thing go. And right there, it's so fast. Oh, the meter were back. The cat dash was just a little too slow. And Illusions is in such a great position right now. He's got the meter lead. He's got the life lead. He's got three arrows loaded up. Oh, did you see how much, Atai, how much respect the tie gave him when they were standing right next to each other doing nothing? And Illusions recognizing that and just doing something accordingly. Yeah, no, you got to take advantage when your opponent's caught there like a deer in headlights. Too scared to press a button. And almost flawlessing him on the first bar of health. Illusions points to take this match. Very smart by Atai there to just neutral jump. He knew if Illusions was going to just regular punish it with a combo that it didn't matter. So he just went for the ballsy wow. neutral jump. Illusions walking forward with that fire arrow. That was frightening. Yeah, Dash is going to do some great damage here. And corner carry. If Illusions is going to wake up or not, that's the mix-up. And he does. Neutral jump by uh, Atai, which, which will avoid, I believe, almost every option that Green Arrow does have a wake-up. The unfortunate thing is that that Stinger put him far out of the corner and rebuilt the space. And Ty's in a very bad situation right here. He does still have Clash, but unfortunately he doesn't have the meter, the meter advantage. So if he does opt to Clash, Green Arrow can meet it. And that's what Ty needed. You're if that jump two would have connected, that mean I'm would have had almost half health leather. going into the final health, bar of health. And Catwoman does have the damage to, to mount a comeback. She has the damage, she has the mix. Cat Dash in a dream. But here come the fire arrows, full screen. Uh, Atai getting a little too antsy, forward dashing Ooh. when he shouldn't be. Gets the, gets the, that's the sweep. Yep. That's and, the sweep. And not watching his legs. As Illusions is about to take this. And guys, Noble Legolas has taken this match. He's going to move on here. In Brennan's, I believe. In his pool. All right, guys, we do have a replay coming up for you. This is going to be Zy Fox's fake mix-up. Pay attention to this. Oh, and into a trade combo. This will be some huge damage. He has almost the same, it's the same exact combo from one. And oh, who was that going to cross up? I would have blocked cross up, let me tell you. Just look at this comeback. And this is right out the gate. Zyfox just was destroyed. Almost a flawless on that first bar. And he just said, you know what? It doesn't matter. Oh! Let's go ahead and do this. Nine out of 10, that's a cross up. And then the air tech catching him with the down one into the ground pound. And look at this conversion at the end. That down one, two at the end of this looked like he had dropped it. That was very last second. So tiny. That hitbox on the down one, two is so small that you can easily miss it. Forward three. Where's oh. it hitting? No idea. You know what? Who knows? Who knows? Flash knows. Yep. <laughs> Only the Flash. He actually went back in time, knew what the mix-up was going to be, and told himself, do this, because guess what? They're not going to block it. Look at this. Look how low he gets to the ground and how easy it is. Oh, no, we cut away. But it's very, very easy to miss that last down one, two.